Right, it is Friday morning. It's just, just gone half past six. Hubby's gone to work. He left at ten past six. My son has got a day off today and he's awake. So we're off to Tesco's. So we're going to get our food shop done pretty early. I'm not having it delivered by Iceland this week. We thought we'd go for Tesco's for a change. So hopefully we'll take you along our day. I will be doing a vlogging day today. And we are going to the cinema to see a Marvel Endgame. Um, we'll see how this day goes anyway. Follow me along. Right, we're just coming up to the Western Fable Shopping Centre and the Tesco's. Now this Tesco's used to be a 24 hour Tesco's. It used to open all night. Crikey, isn't it empty? Where shall I park? Um, I think we're going to be struggling for a spot, my darling. I don't know where to park. Have they got a body there? <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's because they've got these big machines here as well. Never seen it this empty, not for a while. Funny enough, I used to come really early like this. Should I park here? No, I, oh. fancy, I fancy going over here actually. It's gone the end. Let's park here instead. When it's like it's like his dad. The more spaces there is, the more pain they are to actually um park i know that lady over there um that's beside the point but anyway we're going to go into tesco's and then get our food shop done take it home and then we'll go on to the cinema Isn't that what your dad wanted? No, your dad mentioned it as well. You well, we might have to mention it to your dad then. We are having a competition here to see who can get to the cashiers first. Um, <laughs> there, there, there's a lot of cheating going on here. They're trying to put everybody's products away. Yeah. And getting in the way. Come on then, Daniel. We've got to move it then. You've got a shadow behind you. Yeah, it's still competition. They are next door there. That's my father. So, uh, aren't you enjoying this? No, it's tiring. <laughs> so here we are. Too slow. <laughs> Quite cold out here, isn't it? Yeah, the difference. Right, with this end.
Did it go in me, darling? This is, oh, by the way, this is uh, my son's car. This is Dinky Green. He usually moans when um, Just. I get my food shop. Normally we have it on the back seat, don't we? So, and then we get home, put it away, and get off to the cinema. Are you having a rant, me darling? Yes, it's not fair. It's well, moaning at all the cars were in one spot and then it's completely I'll take it down because the kids are going to school so I don't want to get any of the kids in the shop. But look, look how empty it is over there and it's complaining because they're all in one spot. Aren't you my darling? Yes, I'm not having it. I'm but a formal complaint put in. <laughs> I think it's because obviously it's not it's completely empty because they're still getting off the kids off to school. So um, here we go, and um, they are actually building up here. It'd be lovely to see what the um, houses are like. Although I think they're going to be quite cramped, aren't they? Because they, this plot is um, getting quite a lot of houses on in that. And we do have a police station. Is it two or three we have in Northampton now? Uh, don't know. Kids. So that's one of them. Um, we do have, um, well, we did have three, but I think we're down to two now. And I say, normally I walk all along here. She's being very brave, actually. She's scared of people. Yep. So, Gothic! What's Goth. this one called? That one's called Shadow, and that one's called Gothic. <laughs> Goth, come here! <laughs> Isn't it good when they know now? Hello Out. there. Come and get your picture too. Hello. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're looking. Got the bacon. You're seeing what's interesting, aren't ya? <laughs> Hello. 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 Right, I'll quickly do the Tesco haul. I won't be saying all the prices because I need to get the food away because I say we are actually going back out. We're going to the cinema. So we got the rolls here, got fresh and the fresh bread, milk. A lot of these were actually on offer. Um, my family tend to like these pepperoni minis. I can't stand them. The coronation chicken, got two of those because we are having jacket potatoes later. Um, cheese slices, Tesco's homemade, homemade. Um, we have these with the burgers. Tomatoes there, Scotch eggs. These um, cocktail sausages were 70, I think it was £1.50, which is a really good offer. We've got our Cornish pasties here, and we've got these straws, which I love. And they, were, I know they were on offer at £10 for a pound, so I had those. Uh, my son doesn't very often eat fish, so he's going to have this sweet garlic butter chicken Kievs. I got the snack box this week, 36 packets for £6, I think it was. I'm sure it was. Was it £6? I don't know. I will have to check that. I can't actually remember, but I think it was £6. Um, got this lovely shopping bag. Haven't used it. Um, Disney Winnie the Pooh with all different characters on there. I think that's really good. Oh, it's got Tesco's, I think it's the same. Oh, it's got poo on the back there, look. I really wish I'd got myself one. This is actually to put on my granddaughter's pieces in that we've bought her over the last couple of weeks. So I will put them all in there. These are off the hula hoops, and these are six packets of barbecue beef. The Pringles were on offer again. 112, was it? Yeah, the Pringles were on offer, as you know, they can go up to like £2.29 a tube. With the Uncle Ben's rice, we did have, I think it was the vegetable one before. These were down to 84p. 
but this time we've had savoury chicken flavoured rice and the spicy Mexican rice. Um, we've got the cookers. They were half price, but I think there was something like 62 pence. Not sure what the potatoes actually weighed, but they're for our jackets. Um, the, this is a very small um, coat. This is because we want it to um, go to the cinema. Um, Monster Drink is my son's when he's at work. Sometimes he takes this, because sometimes it takes him ages to have a break, depending on how busy they are. The Purcell's non bile that was on offer for four pounds, and that's for 38 washes. As you know, I normally get my bold and that from Poundland. Um, I've got two packets of the bird's eye chicken breast dippers. I know they were on offer. Um, the sweet barbecue pork pork, that was two for six pounds. I've got a packet of sausages because I want to do banners and mash. I'm sure we have actually had these burgers thinking about it because um, my son picked these up, but look, they're the caramelised onion, and I, I just love onion. I like onion raw, fried, whatever. So I'm sure we've had these before. So as I said, we normally have Iceland. But back there we've got um, painted chips. Don't think we've had these before. I'm sure we haven't. I don't recognise the bag. Thought we'd try these um, in the oven, trying to get away from frying if I can. This we haven't had before. Salt and pepper ridge chips, so I've got for a change. Might even have those along with our fish. And we've got this one this week. Um, this is the lemon herb. Same, I'll see just not eat fish. Hobby prefers plain of chicken when we have some fried chicken um, or hot and spicy chicken. So I've just got him a couple of plain ones. And yeah, there's my naughty sausage roll from the baguette shop. And we did pick up the Tesco little mini brochure. And a lot of this, I think I might have um, videoed quite a bit of this over the last week or so. This is like the spring and summer. I sort of do like picking these um, leaf bits up. I do tend to make sure that I do read it or look through it. And then it goes in my recycle bin. <laughs> but I love all the pastel colours. And yes, I did actually see these. These are on my, um, I videoed these. I don't remember seeing that one, mind you. But I did see the others. I'm just showing you the pictures and that. It's quite dark actually, but that is still nice. And then there's that bedding. Right, now I must get my food away, eat my sausage roll so we can actually get out to the cinema. Sixfields now. Um, we do have the Sixfield Stadium here. Um, what else have we got? We've got the um, bowling alley. Um, a bunch of fast food places. Yeah, there's a couple of restaurants around. Um, KFC over there. Um, the stadium we actually go past. Um, that will be on the right. So um, it does get busy. Um, best to come here if you're coming to anything other than football come obviously when there's not a football match on because it could be horrendous so there is the um, stadium there um, got Fridays that we just passed KFC is just there and then we're coming up next is um, the cinema and the bowling alley as well.
slow, doesn't it? <laughs> Where shall we park this time? Oh, let's not go there. This is the best time to come. It is um, just gone half nine at the moment. We were just saying before we come out, it went dark, it started raining. It felt like about three or four o'clock. I have been awake since three o'clock this morning, mind you. And even um, my son said, because he got up early, even though it's his um, day off, it just seems a lot later. But this is the ideal time to come because it's not holiday time. The kids are at school and it's only obviously um, a few people normally come, don't they? Yeah, it's because some people have to go to work. We haven't got the super screen this time, have we? I don't think. Don't know. Right, here we go. So we do like this cinema. Um, so it is sort of the absolute other side of town from where we actually live. We have got another cinema. What's the other one in town? Yeah. The view, isn't it? Um, but as I said, I think they've both been done up fairly recently, haven't they? Yeah. And I guess that is our movie there. So here we go. So look at this. I do like the atmosphere. I have done a video of this before. Just exiting the cinema, aren't we, Daniel? Yeah. We got here about half nine and it's just coming up to half one. <laughs> that was a long movie. Although, okay, the movie didn't start till about, what, 10 o'clock-ish, wasn't it? But still, with all the credits and everything. Right, we're on our way home, as I was saying. Um, the credits and everything, the movie was long, was it not? And I was surprised actually because even with the length of the movie, they did actually still show trailers and everything, which was really good. One of mine is um, Men in Black International. Nah, it's all about Toy Story 4. Yeah, he wants to see Toy Story 4. There's, there's a couple, you know, there's Titans coming on. But as I said, it does run to, quite expensive to go to the cinema all the time. Um, so there's certain ones we definitely want to watch, but we'll probably wait till they come out on DVD and I'm not going to give anything away in case anybody does go to see um, Marvel Endgame. I think we both can say it's the best. 
Yes? Yeah. Yeah. So, um, I'm not going to leave it there because as I say in case um, somebody obviously watching my video will gradually or at some point watch the movie, brilliant, I can't say anything more about that and um, as I said it's, it's getting on now so we're going to go home now. Hope you've enjoyed this video, thanks for watching, goodbye.